Hello, I'm Karen Larson with a look at some of your top stories from 2 News Oklahoma. An East Tulsa home heavily damaged tonight, but nobody's injured after a car crashed into the home near 31st and Garnett. Tulsa police tell us a man in his 80s was driving when one foot apparently got stuck under the brake. The other caught on the accelerator. Police said the car was going about 60 miles an hour when the man drove through a fence, went airborne, drove through two backyards, then into a third backyard before hitting the back bedroom of the home. TPD says no one was in the bedroom at the time, but there was a woman and her son at home. They weren't hurt and neither was the driver. The emergency room at Oklahoma State Medical Center in Tulsa is back open this evening after a biohazard scare forced it to close temporarily this morning. The Tulsa Fire Department tells us a man walked into the ER with a glove he said was filled with ricin and that someone was trying to hurt him with the poison. The man was inside the ER for about 10 minutes and then left, taking the glove and the unknown substance with him. Tulsa Fire cleaned the area as a precaution while medical workers checked ER patients and staff. Now, OSU says that police do have a suspect in custody and he did not have a biohazardous material with him. Well, Tulsa police hope these surveillance pictures will lead them to a suspected porch pirate. They're looking for this woman. Officers call her a person of interest in a string of home burglaries in East Tulsa. Detectives believe the woman has taken packages from numerous porches and leaves in a dark colored four door vehicle. If you recognize the woman or the car, call Crime Stoppers 918-596-COPS. Your 10 day forecast looking unbelievable for this time of year. Check out these temperatures 70 your afternoon high for Wednesday, but we're going to warm up to almost record territory 77 degrees for the afternoon on Thursday with southwest breezes 75 on Friday. We're going to cool off a bit over the weekend, but it's still going to be nice 63 Saturday 65 Sunday right staying in those 50s and 60s for all of next week as well. Warming up the end of next week and that's our time. Stay with two news.